Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back. It is Monday, which means it's the start of the first week of my new schedule, which is guaranteed shifts Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So that'll be interesting. I think, I don't think by the end of this week, but definitely next week I should get all those seat covers finished because like I always say, like I don't really have enough time to fill four, or like enough work to fill four hours on a regular basis. And now I have two extra shifts this week unrelated to production, so we'll see. <laughs> anyway, I had some crazy dreams again last night as I always seem to. I don't know, it weird. Um, I think it's like, I, I think, I, did I, uh, English, did I mention it? Um, when I stopped like drinking pop all the time and like caffeine, my, my dreams have just been like going crazy and I think my brain is just like, yeah, it's nuts. I don't really remember what they were. There was definitely some like skids in a warehouse type setting and some product. Um, and I was also at the theater at one point. I don't know, it was just weird. Anyway, I didn't, I didn't, I could have slept longer. <laughs> I, that wasn't what I was saying, but also I could have slept longer, but I get to sleep in tomorrow and I think I will take advantage of it, we'll see. But for today, um, just gonna try to get my tasks done as quickly as possible, um, and then I guess sew, and then go home. I'm hoping I can finish my one embroidery project today, and honestly, if I push it, I could probably get both done. I don't have any sewing projects on the list for this week, other than I would love to add bare minimum, I cut out my pajama short bottoms. Although I should really get both patterns, like the shirt and the shorts, just to make sure that I don't like screw up and not have enough fabric. Anyway, I am rambling now for no reason. I'm gonna go have my breakfast drink and try to wake up a little bit more before I get this day started. Alrighty, well, it is the end of my work day. I am the only one who's been here. <laughs> I'm gonna leave now, lock everything up, alarm everything, because no one else is gonna be here because it's a Monday, nobody comes in on Monday. Like, a lot of our deliveries are scheduled, like set schedules, so if you order from them, they deliver on a certain day, and that certain day is Monday, and so we've struggled to like get stuff to show up because nobody's here. <laughs> And so I feel like I'm gonna have some really sad Mondays coming up because there's just gonna be nobody here. At least like on Tuesdays, there was, if not um, someone in like admin, the text came in on Tuesday, every Tuesday, but now it's just me on Monday. And like, honestly, yesterday it was just me too. It's so sad, <laughs> there's nobody here. Anyway, um, doing great with the seat covers. There's only 16 untouched ones left. That's not to say we only have 16 left because I'm working on a set of five right now, but it's very exciting. My stack of completed ones is now 16. Oh, <laughs> um, which is very exciting. So like I said, within, cause I can usually get five done in just under, in just under two shifts. Cause usually I get like finish it. And then like, anyways, um, so, Wednesday. I should, might be able to finish them this week. We will see. But in any case, I'm going to pack up my bag now because I need to peace out. It is a beautiful sunny day today. So maybe I'll go for a walk. We'll see. Um, can't see my friend. Well, can't get into a car with my friend because my mom had to drive someone who had been traveling outside of the province. And so we're just being extra cautious, abundance of caution because no, <laughs> like, immune system at all my friend has. So maybe I'll go by myself. We will see. We'll see how I feel once I get home and maybe have some lunch. Anyways, I'm gonna go now. I will check in with you as again. Well, hello again. It is 20 after two. I came home. I had lunch. I, actually, sorry, I lazed in my bed for a while. I had lunch. I lazed in my bed some more, but bed is made. Floor is found. I put all my dirty clothes in the hamper and then I just have a couple clothes there that I need to put away. So I'm feeling pretty good about things. Also, it's time to cut more elastic. Um, basically, 
I was initially going to make like Tuesday the day where I cut things that I need to cut. <laughs> Um, but I decided to move it to Monday, so I'm just going to cut a bunch of elastic and then maybe some mask liners, just so, you know, I have some. And then I want to finish at least one of my embroidery pieces today. I think I can do it. We'll see. Anyway, that's where we're at. I'm just going to watch something. Haven't decided what yet. And just go chop, chop, chop. Alrighty, hello, I am back. <laughs> What even? Why do I have so much energy? It is 20 after 5. I am almost done my one embroidery project, which is super exciting. I fixed up the issues that I have, and now I'm just filling in one last thing that I was, like, torn between filling in before. There's definitely something I have to fix on part of it that I've since I fixed it last, but it's fine. But I got some fun mail, so let's open this up. So, hey, look, I have scissors right here. Are they my fabric scissors? Yes. Am I hoping to get fabric scissors, like actual fabric scissors for Christmas? Also yes. These are just sharp scissors. Anyway, for the last couple of months, I have been doing some virtual challenges um, through the Conqueror Virtual Challenges, and um, here's my medals. <laughs> Legitimately, turns out medals are a great motivator for me. I was like trying to figure out ways to like make myself get out and walk. It's a medal. A metal will do it for me. So I finished two of them and then I switched to pacer challenges and I've been doing those but I can't figure out how to like manually input my walks. It just it tracks through my phone and it just tracks every single step I take and so that's annoying and also they send you the medals whether you complete it or not whereas with the conqueror challenge they only send it to you after you complete it. So like there's no reward on the other one. And so I like ordered a couple challenges and then they immediately sent me my medals. I still haven't got them yet, but they should be here soon if these ones have made it here, but I'm almost done the last of those challenges. Anyways, I'm 16.9 miles into 24. I don't know what that is, means. Kilometers are my thing. Anyway. I, s I started with the smallest challenge and I did the English Channel Challenge. I cannot remember, 34 kilometers, I think. And, ooh, <laughs> look how pretty that is. Like, straight up. Like, <laughs> wouldn't, you, wouldn't you walk 30, 34 kilometers? Is it 34 kilometers? 21 kilometers. 20, 21 miles. 34 kilometers I'm so I don't can't convert it does not say on it but isn't this so pretty look I get a medal because I walked <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> anyway as I said turns out medals are a good motivator and so I did a second one this one was the Inca trail which I'm not sure how long it was but whoop there's that medal Look how, look how pretty it is. <laughs> so this one was 26.2 miles. So like maybe like 37 kilometers. I'm just trying to remember how long it was. And I cannot get look at, ooh, this is nice too. It's nice quality. Look at that. It's heavy. It's not like, I was a little bit afraid that they might be like not nice metals, but they doing all right. So yeah, they smell weird, but that's their only downside <laughs> anyway. Like I said, I have another three on the way for the other challenges, and then I did purchase another challenge through the Conqueror's virtual challenges, because like I said, medals, who knew? I knew, because honestly, in middle school, they would give you medals for getting on the honor roll, and I was like, yes, I must do this, and then, so you get medal roll, medal, so you get medals for academics, you get medals for athletics, and you get medals for leadership, so I joined leadership solely so I'd get a medal. <laughs> And um, I made sure to play on two sports teams solely so I'd get a medal because he had to do two sports teams, I'm pretty sure. And then obviously I got good grades, so I'd keep getting that medal. Anyways, that's where we're at. <laughs> what the heck even? But yeah, so if you're struggling to motivate yourself, I guess just sign up for a medal. I think it's like 30 US, so it's probably like 35 Canadian. Um, and that includes shipping for them to send you the medal. And then pro tip, when you buy a challenge from them after you purchase that challenge they'll be like hey do you want to get this one for x amount off 
And so um, if you think you're gonna do two challenges, at least it's worth it. Anyways, I need to clean this up now cause it's a mess and find somewhere to put my cool metals. Yeah, I did that. I did that. <laughs> anyway, away I go. I just want to share that because that's cool. I've been waiting for those for a while. I think I started end of September is when I started doing those. I got significantly faster on the second one. I need to get back to it though, but like I said, it's pacer challenges. They just, they, this is just not as fun because this, they just send you the medals anyways and I hate that. Anyways, I'm gonna go back to embroidery before dinner here and um, see if I can get that done before dinner. It'll be, it'll be close. Listen, watching people play Among Us has become my new vice. It's terrible. Hours, just hours, hours, hours. Anyway, in that time, I did finish my one project. Um, I also finally put the interfacing on the back of my tote here so that if I use it or if I sell it and somebody uses it, the threads don't rip and tear apart. So that was key. And I see my battery is about to die, so that is great, but it is like quarter to 12. So I think I need to go to sleep now. I don't work tomorrow, which is super exciting. And therefore, I think I'm going to sleep in. We'll see. Maybe I'll wake up early. I don't know, but I think I'm going to sleep in. And then I think I definitely need to go for a walk tomorrow because I'm I'm feeling super lazy. So with that, I'm going to say thanks for coming along on today's adventure and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.